in-depth coverage of the top stories and breaking news when it happens. News Radio 1080 KRLD. And this is the day where it's acceptable to be frightened and watch scary movies. And new research finds watching these kinds of movies that scare you to death might be good for you. Doesn't seem right. Let's bring in Dr. Fami Farah from Bentley Heart Health in the KRLD Zoom room. So, Dr. Farah, how can horror movies be good for you? <laughs> Well, from my standpoint and your standpoint, just the fun of it, you know, like we all live such difficult lives. Why not enjoy it a little bit? I, I, I see no issues with that. From a health perspective, this research has shown that all of these, the, the jumps and the flinches that horror movies cause to you actually release chemicals in your brain that can actually help you. It's the fight or flight response that they're talking about. It actually has good and bad, to be honest with you. I think the good part they're talking about is like, you know, getting your heart rate up and it's kind of similar effect to what you get when you exercise, right? Those endorphins uh, releasing. And so I, that's what they're talking about, like um, similar similar to exercise effects. That would be the good side of things. But it also can have a little bit of a bad side because especially in those who have pre-existing heart conditions like, you know, heart attack and things like that, um, you, you do have to be a little bit careful, like, you know, because uh, the fight or flight response also releases some catecholamines, which is like your... Um, it's what raises your heart rate and stuff. So it can have a stress response as well. What about adrenaline as well? Exactly, adrenaline. That is uh, that's that is the hormone in your f fight or flight response. That is the hormone that actually drives that whole uh, high heart rate and that heightened alertness, so to speak, when you're watching a scary movie. When you're watching something like that, especially if there are multiple scares within a film, how long does that effect last? Uh, not very long. Um, you know, you're uh, very similar to exercise. That's why I keep going back to that. Like uh, when you're exercising, very similar hormones are released and your heart rate goes up. Actually, your blood pressure will go up too during that time. And then once the movie ends, similar to once your exercise ends, um, slowly all that's going to go down in the next couple of minutes, probably, you know, 10 to 15 minutes usually. And then your body will get back to normal. Um, so, yeah, the effect is not very long lasting. Uh, but from exercise, yes, you will. There's enormous um, benefits to exercise, as we all know, because, you know, it's not just about the hormones it's releasing. It's the overall fitness. So, uh, you know, you exercise your muscles. Your heart is a muscle. As you're exercising, it, it gets stronger and you retain more oxygen, which helps your entire body. With the, a horror movie, you get that effect for a little bit, and I think that's what the study is talking about, that there's a little bit of a beneficial effect for that temporary time phase, but it honestly does not does not uh, it, it compared to exercise. That's Dr. Fami Farah from Bentley Hard Health.